What's up, y'all? We back at it. Another video. Doing some installation today on the uh, on the scat pack. Um, already got her cleaned up. That's what we got going today. Doing our uh, sunroof decal. Got in here. Kill, you kill the copyright one time, player. Kill the copyright. So what we got going on here is we prepped this windshield, uh, this sunroof. We cleaned it really, really well with alcohol. Got it all measured out. Um, even got it taped off. It's about, an, well it is, it's an inch and a half from this uh, black edge to the uh, painted side of the car. So that's a good gauge, one and a half inches on each side. The front will need to be trimmed. You can see right here um, where it hits the, uh, guess the rubber seal around the windshield or the uh, damn it sunroof uh, it's got to be trimmed so next thing we're gonna do is we got some uh, tint off tint on the opposite of tint off and uh, we're gonna spray this window down get it nice and wet I already went through with the, uh, with the spreader and uh, made sure that decals down nice and tight um, so now what we got to do is Peel half of this back, spray the window, uh, the uh, sunroof with the tint spray, basically like a baby soap and water. And then uh, get under here and peel this second layer back. You can see I already started peeling a little bit. And then we'll start uh, spreading this down. So we'll catch you guys once we make the cut. I'm doing this myself. So uh, once we have this back on, we'll, uh, we'll go ahead and get you back. All right, cool. All right, y'all. So, uh... I'll tell you right now, that is not a one person job. Uh, that decal is way too big. If there's any kind of uh, wind, uh, it's gonna be a problem. Um, not only that, uh, it's a big ass decal. Gotta use a lot of uh, tint on on that, that sunroof to try to get it to where you can slide the thing around. And uh, decal's so big, by the time I pulled all the protective paper off, um, the fucker kind of slid a little bit and one side locked down. So uh, I'm so happy with the way it came out. Uh, it just, it's probably shifted over quarter to half an inch to the right side of the car. Um, but, but either that or sacrifice the entire decal. So uh, let's check it out. It's gonna be kind of hard to see, but uh, Looks fucking clean, man. It's got the scat B. As you can see, look at, I don't know. It's like an inch on that side. And if we come around, you know. What would life be like if we didn't show you all the uh, the real world stuff, right? Because let's face it, man, I know we're perfect. Oh yeah, by the way, we NorCal challenges for real. So here's the other side. You can see it's about a half inch, so shifted a little bit. Had to make a cut on that one honeycomb. Uh, looks like we got a little bubbling, but uh, come through and, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's got a couple little, you know, if that's the extent of the bubbles, fuck it, you know, it's not too bad. Um, better than paying somebody to have it installed. So let's take a look at what it looks like inside the car. Be my first time looking too with y'all. So this should be dope. Open the sunroof panel and uh, oh, scatty should be shining through. Move all this stuff out of the way here. Oh, girl! Yeah, that looks fucking good. So, yeah, you roll in. See it, boy. Got that red couch from the 80s, Yamshin. The shit. Got the Barton. Sheehee! 
Sheesh. It looks pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. Happy. All right, y'all. Well, that's pretty much gonna complete this one. I uh, gotta do a little cleanup here around the garage, but uh, that's how you install the uh, the uh, sunroof decal. Um, I know I skipped a lot of steps, but man, that thing's big. Basically, any decal, just bigger. You know, wet wet it real good. Uh, use your squeegee tool. Get everything locked down real well, and then uh, slowly, slowly peel that top layer back and. Hope everything sticks, but uh, peace out. Y'all have a great day. Like, subscribe, follow, all that jazz. Hit the bell, and we will holler at you on the next one.